we are going to talk about the endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi apparatus, vacuoles, lysosomes and all of this. So what are these called as? Are responsible for all of this end-to-end -end services. That's why I told you like a industry. Right? They have specific function of the cell like mitochondria doing energy production. Endoplasmic reticulum has to send it to the modifying center. So it will go and merge with the cell membrane that means your plasma membrane that system is called as endomembrane system let me see i'm giving you the challenge is the challenge accepted if so if you think you can answer this question answer it in the comment box hello guys welcome to the session this is devika your biology buddy and we are talking about the fundamental unit of life uh -huh. but what are we going to talk about today particularly we are going to talk about all of this yes we are going to talk about the endoplasmic reticulum golgi apparatus vacuoles lysosomes and all of this so what are these called as organelles you'll say yes surely you're right cell organelles but i am focusing on a particular terminology which is known as the endomembrane system right so as you told ki yes this is cell organelle you thought right ki this is cell organelle that we are talking about so what are cell organelles cell organelles are you know evolved developed small organ like structure just like we have heart kidney uh, liver similarly cells have the small organ like structures which carry out particular functions which has those chemicals embedded in them that can carry out certain metabolic processes right those are called as the cell organelle they have specific function right they have specific function of the cell like mitochondria doing energy production protein synthesis by the rough endoplasmic reticulum the lipid synthesis by the smooth endoplasmic reticulum so they have been you know given a specific role to play in the cell now imagine this entire cell to be like a factory yeah and each organelle over here is doing its own job yes each organelle over here is doing its own job now when things are placed over here like this all these organelles should there be any connection between them is it required or not required or cell to cell connection is sufficient surely there must be some connection hai na? because dna is sitting right into the center over here inside the nucleus it's not coming out it sends out the ribosomes it sends out the mrnas and all right so those ribosomes are now stuck over here on the endoplasmic reticulum giving it rough endoplasmic reticulum look some of them are uh, you know placed into the cytoplasm uh, doing the protein synthesis now protein synthesis is happening in the endoplasmic reticulum endoplasmic reticulum has to send it to the modifying center the packaging center which is surely your golgi apparatus or golgi bodies whatever you like to call it right and from there it has to now be sent out so there must be an interlink between them and that my dear student makes up your endomembrane system right so it is composed of group of membranes of different compartments right different compartments from here to here to here right so different compartments and they are present a group of membrane compartments right they are present in eukaryotic cell only and what they do work for they work for modification packaging transportation of lipids and protein they are, are responsible for all of this end-to-end -end services that's why i told you like a industry like in an industry if synthesis is happening if they are producing certain kind of a material it has to be you know quality checked it has to be packed modified and then sent to the customer end to end Similarly, if inside a cell also synthesis is happening and delivery is also happening, that means there should be a connection, right? And that connection, all those organelles are together, which are in connection of modification, synthesis, right? Modification, packaging, transportation are uh, working together. That system is called as endomembrane system. Two words over here, you see endo in 
right within membrane which has membrane bounded structures right so group of membranes or organelles in eukaryotic cells right so they are doing what lipids and protein ka modification packaging transport that is called as endomembrane system so here synthesis of protein is happening they are sending it in the form of the vesicles so vacuoles are also a part of this right so transported uh, this vesicles this vesicles are now going to go and get merged with what with your golgi complexes golgi apparatus here modification packaging will happen right modification is happening here as well here it is specific kind of foldings and uh, packaging stuff is happening after that it is also making another the vesicles now this vesicles can be coming from different sources it can also come from lysosomes okay so there also it can come or it can go in the lysosome merge it if we want to destroy it right if the thing is not correct for us we want to kill it off so lysosome it can go and merge lysosome is also involved over here now we want to deliver this thing to outside of the cell so it will go and merge with the cell membrane that means your plasma membrane so plasma membrane is also involved right so what are the members of this endomembrane system it's like certain kind of you know group which is sophisticatedly involved in production modification transportation of proteins and lipid so what do we have under the endomembrane system we have golgi complexes vacuoles plasma membrane lysosome and endoplasmic reticulum all of these organelles all these five organelles are the members of endomembrane system although the plasma membrane okay although the plasma membrane is not kind of inside the cell though we are saying endo endo but from inside the cell it is merging and taking and delivering it out right out of the cell so technically it is not involved inside or endo but it is also doing its job so that's why it is a part of endomembrane system itself justified because that can be a doubt hey ma'am you said endo within now plasma membrane is not within so why endomembrane so to give the justification over here it is involved in transportation yeah to send it out that's why then the system explains the interdependency and interconnection as we have discussed earlier things cannot be done by solely there should be an interconnection within the cell just like inside a factory things should be uh, connected that's why right then the plasma membrane interacts with other endomembrane systems as well right so it is basically one place where uh, you know this vesicles are being merged vesicles are being sent so it is working with everybody over there so side from where secreted proteins are exported out that's why plasma membrane is a part of it right an endomembrane system it does not include what it does not include certain kind of organelles like your mitochondria uh, chloroplast or peroxisomes for that matter they are not involved in the endomembrane system all right so who are the members once more time you have endoplasmic reticulum then you have vacuoles golgi complexes yeah lysosomes plasma membrane these are the members of endomembrane system all right guys so can you answer this question for me now let me see i am giving you the challenge is the challenge accepted if so if you think you can answer this question answer it in the comment box the endomembrane system of the cell inside is what of the following endoplasmic reticulum golgi bodies and mitochondria uh er golgi body vacuole microtubules er golgi body lysosome vacuoles er golgi bodies chloroplast or and lysosome so what do you think which one is this so chloroplast is also type of plastid okay just giving you a hint to solve fantastic thank you for watching the video try and answer this let me see whether my rock stars can answer this question see you tata take care the answer would be given in the telegram link see you there bye bye